Hey guys, welcome back. Um, it's been like at least three to four weeks that I haven't recorded anything. And the reason for that is because I was sick for like two weeks. I'm still a little bit sick. I cough here and then, and then my nose is still stuffy a little bit. So yeah, that happened. And then I was on the process of moving to a new room. So as you can tell, this is my new room. Um, this and the burgundy right here is my background for the videos that I'm gonna do for the future So I have that and then the light is like right here my um, My lighting so it's right there um, So yeah, I mean and then because of the holidays as well I didn't have a chance to record anything like any other New Year's um, Makeup or anything. I was so busy and I was on the transition of moving to this new room so yeah um as you can tell i'm my nose is stuffy um so yeah that's what's been going on in my life um i'm settled now everything is you know um uh, good in my room i will do a room tour um as soon as i can so stay tuned for that the urban decay eyeshadow primer potion and anti-aging So to start off, we're starting off with the Studio On The Go Makeup Palette, um, and this is more like a purpley um, eyeshadow, so we're definitely going in with this gray one, and that's going to be our transition shade. And then with the same palette, we're going to go ahead and use this one right here, this like dark burgundy purplish color. And with that one, we're going to do like a halo. Um, so what we're going to do is just focus it in the outer and inner corner. And then with the same brush from the transition shade, you're just going to go ahead and blend that. And then I'm going to go ahead and finish my face makeup and then I'll be right back. And now going back with the palette, we're going to go in with, um, I'll say with these two um, colors. This one looks more silvery in the camera. I don't know why, but as you can see, it's not that silvery. It's more like a light purple color. So we're going to go ahead and put this one in the middle um, to create that halo. And then we're going in with the darker one. And then we're just gonna go ahead and blend the dark one. That way it'll be more like that halo look. And I'm looking this way because I also have a mirror this way that has a little bit more lighting. I have a little mirror right here in front of me, but eh, it's, it doesn't have enough lighting as the other one. And then going back with the transition shade, I'm just going to try to put it on top. And now for the wing liner, I'm using the Master Precise by Maybelline. And I'm going to go ahead and do that off camera and I'm going to curl my lashes and put lashes on off camera as well. So the lashes I'm using are the Wispies ones. Those are my everyday look. 
if I have something else to go like to an occasion like a wedding or like a party or something I would wear something different um, but wispies are my everyday look so yeah I'll be right back now that we have the lashes on and everything else um, I'm gonna go back with um, the dark purple which is this one right here and I'm just gonna attempt to And now for the bottom lashes or bottom eyelid, um, I'm going in with maybe the dark one and a little bit with the gray. Just mix it. And then just go ahead and add eyeliner. And then I'm gonna go ahead and add um, mascara to my bottom lashes. And then for the brown bone highlight, I'm going in with this one right here. Um, actually, with the middle one, it's more like a matte color, so I'm just gonna go ahead and add that to my brow bone. The, this one right here in the corner, this one's more like a white um, shimmery one. So I'm just going to go ahead and add that. And then for highlight, I'm using the Sephora um, Ultra Light um, Radiant Luminizing Drops. And I tried this for the first time. I mean, I've been having this for like around six months, but the first time I tried it, oh my gosh, like it was the best thing ever. I was like, why haven't I used this before? It gives off the perfect highlight. And I'm going in with just like this little brush from um, the highlight by Urban Decay. And if I want to add a little bit more, I can. I'll just add a little bit more. I mean, who doesn't love that highlight? <laughs> Look at that highlight though. <laughs> Ugh, highlight be popping. Just kidding, I don't talk like that. <laughs> All right. And then for the lipstick, or for the lips, I'm using the Matt Hughes um, uh, lip, what is it? Long lasting liquid lip. Um, in matte and it's trustworthy I'm just gonna go ahead and fix a little bit and I'm just gonna add some eyeliner to hide off the glue from the from the lashes and then to set my makeup I'm using the Urban Decay um, 
makeup setting spray. Duh. And that is the finished look. Um, I absolutely love it. So it's like a purpley color, but not that intense. And yeah, I'm sorry about my dogs barking outside. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. I have. I'm so sorry I haven't been um, on YouTube for like past three weeks I'm so sorry about that but um, yeah I hope you guys enjoyed it and I'll do the room to tour the room tour um, in about maybe to today but later on so I hope to see you guys in the next video bye